So where is this important iliopsoas muscle? It's the deepest low back muscle that we have. It's the major postural muscle. It goes from your lumbar spine, crosses the pelvis, and attaches onto the top of the leg. It's joined by the iliacus muscle, which is the ilio part of the iliopsoas muscle, and that tendon joins with the psoas and, again, attaches on the top of the thigh. Now, on a real person, Erica, if you could come be my real person, it goes from the low back, down, crosses the pelvis, and attaches into the inner thigh. Its action as it contracts is to pull the low back into a sway back and tip the pelvis. It's a hip flexor. And if you could come back up. So it should be working in the first about 35 degrees of flexion as you bring your tandu to the front. A very quick and easy way to see if you have a tight iliopsoas is to lie down on the floor. And we're going to try to duplicate the standing alignment. And Erica, if you would slide one leg slowly along the floor to straight and then to join the other. Now we're watching the low back and what we're looking for is the low back arching away from the floor, which it does with Erica. Now when we look at this small sway back, here's her standing alignment. So we know there's going to be a problem when she's just standing in first position and we'd want to stretch that iliopsoas muscle out.